How do you check if a boat is stolen? And how to protect your vessel from theft? Well, that is today's topic. Hey boating enthusiasts, welcome to the Boat Alert Podcast. This is Billy with BoatAlert.com, and today, we will talk about all you need to know about stolen boats. To skip ahead, use the chapters in the description below but stick around till the end as I will talk about lookups for stolen boat databases in a few minutes. If you are not already subscribed to this channel, you may want to consider it because, we have some great boating topics coming up. Let's dive right in. Nowadays, it's a lot easier to steal boats than cars. The reason is that stolen boats can be easily stripped and sold, unlike cars. Most criminals have found the stolen boat business lucrative and they are not about to stop anytime soon unless you educate yourself on how to protect your boat. How to tell if a boat has been stolen. If you buy a stolen boat it can result in criminal charges against you. The most crucial step to finding out if the boat you are about to buy is stolen is to contact the local enforcement agency of your state, province, or region to check the National Database, NCIC. The National Database from the FBI has been fighting crime for 50 years. The FBI database and NICB would be the biggest ones so we suggest checking the hull identification number of the boat. Many locales have made provisions for people to register homemade boats without documentation. Another indicator of a stolen boat is the absence of the boat trailer. Ukafa law was specifically passed to regulate the titling of boats. We speak about it in a previous video. Forging documents for boats registered at the national level can be easy. This is why it's of the utmost importance for you to always verify all documents with the relevant authorities before buying any boat. This includes running the boat abstract of title if the boat is federally documented. If you are in Florida and buying a Florida registered used boat, then make sure to search the Florida Crime Information Center PAW system by the FDLE. Check that with the RCMP if this boat is reported stolen in Canada. Here are some top ways to look up stolen boats. 1. Do a lien check. 2. Do a police check. 3. Hire a theft investigation company or marine investigators. 4. Do a free stolen boat registry search on public websites or a paid search on BoatAlert.com. 5. Educate yourself about the laws surrounding buying and selling of boats. Make sure you know the differences between titling and registration. Not all states title boats. 6. Make a purchasing agreement. The bill of sale should have a clause such as, I certify that I am the rightful owner of the boat and that the boat has no liens on it. So, when are boats stolen, you ask? Most often, boats are stolen while they are on trailers. In terms of the timing, boats can be stolen at all times of the year, boat thefts are more rampant during the summer periods. The security systems of most marinas are weak because they have easy-to-access gates and do not provide a 24-7 guard. Remember, Boat thieves have instead resolved to steal and sell boat parts such as engines, anchors, bimenis, and electronics. So, why are boats stolen? For personal use. Or to sell and make money, or for criminal activities. Guard your keys well and use locks to secure it to the dock with a steel cable. Then remove the batteries. Remove expensive equipment and registration papers. Also invest in an effective alarm system and install fuel or an electrical cutoff device. It is super important to document your boat. Save all its important numbers somewhere, including its HIN, state registration number, decal number, as well as the serial numbers of the engine, outdrive, or transom assembly. We have a bigger list in the article on the blog. Finally, I will end by talking about what to do when your boat is stolen. 1. Contact the marina where the boat was stolen from. 2. Report to the relevant authorities of your state, city, or region. 3. Report to your insurance company. 4. Announce the theft on social media platforms. By far, Florida has the most boat thefts of all states followed by California and Texas. The most targeted brands are Sea Ray, Bayliner, Wellcraft, and Boston Whaler. When it comes to choosing your boat coverage, you have actual cash value and agreed amount value. Most stolen vessels are not recovered but around 30% are. This is slightly positive news. You can learn more in the blog article that accompanies this video, but now that you know the ropes, it's time for this video to pipe down. Leave a comment below if you have other tips for all of us or if you want to see me cover any other topics, I try to reply to all of your comments, one last thing, please give us a thumbs up since it helps others find useful videos, and for more boating topics be sure to shape up and follow this channel, and hit the bell icon to keep us on deck. Alright, that's all we have for you today, and as always, I hope to see you next time. Thanks for listening.